Okay, hello and welcome to another video here on my channel. In this video I want to show you how you can switch back to the old Style Explorer in Windows 11. Windows 11 brings a new designed Windows Explorer with, with a much cleaner user interface and yeah, I like, I have to say I like the new design. It's clean, it's efficient and it only features the, well, the important functions like connecting to an network drive, copy, pasting files and sharing files, deleting files. If you want to go back to the old ribbon style UI, you can do that currently in Windows by adding a registry value. I wrote a small blog post about that so just click the link below in the video description to get more information. Okay, let's get started. As I mentioned, we have to create a registry key to, in order to switch back to the old Explorer. Here's a registry key. It's quite complicated. Hey, key, local machine, software, Microsoft, Windows, current version, shell extensions blocked. And in that folder, you have to create an empty ID string entry with the following ID. Okay, you don't have to type this up. I prepared a rec data you can import into your registry and you can download it here from our website. The download is a zip file. You can find it here and just unzip the old Explorer registry file from that folder. Here it is. I already extracted the file and before you open the file or import it to your registry, it's always a good advice to check the file and see what you are importing into your registry because there might be also harmful registry files on the internet. So in general, don't trust any download, always check it. Okay, let's open the file in Notepad. It's just a text file. And as we can see, we create a registry key here in the following folder with the following ID. Okay, now we want to import it. How we do that? We right click on the registry file and select open here. There's a warning. We have to click run here and there's another warning and another warning. So be careful what you import. In our case, it's okay. It just creates the following key here to activate the old style Explorer. Okay, we have to click yes to continue. And now the values are added to our registry. And the Explorer did not change yet. We have to restart the Explorer or the computer. So we can open the task manager and select the Windows Explorer here and click restart. And once we have done that, we have switched back to the old style Explorer. As we can see here, now we have back our ribbon UI with much more options and a different design. Okay, that's the old style Windows Explorer we know from Windows 10. Of course, we can also switch back to the new design. In order to do that, we have to delete the registry key we just created. Okay, let's open a registry, the registry editor via the start menu. Okay, here we go. And now we have to go to our newly created registry key. Okay, I have still my old text file, my registry file open here. So I copy the path from the registry file and paste it in here in the address or navigation bar. And now we are at the folder here and here we can see our registry key we have created with the ID, with the long ID here. Okay, just right click and select delete and acknowledge with yes. And now we have to again restart our Explorer. Let's do that. Restart. And if we open the Explorer again, we have switched back to the new design. Okay, that's how you can switch between the new design and the old design with the ribbon UI. And depending what you like more. Do you like more the classic design or do you want to use the new design? Of course, there might be a chance that Microsoft will remove the old style in a further Windows version or with another update. And it's most likely that no new functions will be added to the 
legacy version of the Windows Explorer. Until that, you can still use the old style Windows Explorer. Okay, well, that's it and goodbye.